No more. Please redesign your minds and stop with what we call knife crime. Cause we ain't got the strength to be digging more grave holes and grieving these lost souls. Poor mothers can't heal, can't turn back time as they sit by their windows wishing for a sign as to why their son's life was stolen. Hoping there's some mistake and praying for little man to come home as she stares through the glass trying to stay brave. But she's hurting and deep down Mumsy knows her son ain't returning in the same clothes he left him. He ain't walking down that same London road alive and composed. He's gone. It's unbearable to see a mother bury her young one. To witness families being ripped apart by grief, uncles gritting their teeth, hungry for revenge, it can't go on. Something's gotta be done. Communities need to strive for better whilst working together. We all have stuff to get off our chest, but instead we hit the roads and put on those stab-proof vests. We're paranoid and shook for our lives, and I get it because you don't know who the hell's carrying a knife. None of us were born to be bad and we certainly weren't born to be killers. So let's use our wise brains and allow the hype cause deep down we're all the same. We're scared, we're heartbroken, we're traumatised and we've somehow lost our ways. So please, no more. Please, you're too young to die, too young to fly to the skies with other passers who pass you by like angels in the clouds. We ain't ready to be angels, we want to grow up. Have a family, fulfill our dreams, make something of this particular life, so really deep this and deep it right. Our young ones are being murdered all through the night. I've lost too many people over the years, nearly lost a brother 2018, aka my bestie, my twinny twin twin. Who are you to think you can take a next person's life? Who are you to take away a family's precious jewel? Who are you to rip the life out of a fellow brethren, a fellow sistrin? Stop doing those in the system a favour by making their lives easier as it's one less working class kid living, one less refugee kid progressing, one less black kid excelling or learning or simply breathing. They love this so-called black on black violence and I quote black on black because it's not as simple as just black people killing black people, it's more than that. The media keeps twisting shit, saying it's only black kids in London that carry knives but if you travel the UK and other parts of the world you'll see it's just the same but they don't call it white on white violence, they just call it violence. So what's the difference? You were all just born babies, free from chains but now all is left are bloodstains. You weren't meant to die before dawn. It ain't fair youthful ones, know your worth and let's all begin to position ourselves within this universal realm we call life, earth. This place we call home. Just know you are wanted, you are loved and you are cherished. Every single one of you, so please, no more. I get it may not feel like it, especially when all people care about is Brexit and it's bullshit. Spending money we supposedly don't have on government bonuses and war crimes when we need to use this supposed money on the youths. The youth clubs that have provided conscious activities for our youth. The apprenticeships, the schooling, the sports, holistic health, the NHS that have saved our youth, saved my brother, the list goes on and on and on. We understand these tough times as we trod through these rough winds, but please keep breathing young kings and queens. Remember you are special and you are worthy of life.